my channel. Today's video is gonna be the main shopping haul. You all get me by now. I always post those over you, but they're always up ever since I started doing these monthly shopping hauls, which is from last year. I've never skipped one, so it may be late, but it will be on. So I have got quite some stuff to show you, so let's just start. First of all, I'm gonna show you this briefly. If you follow me, I uploaded a video with the Catrice new products because I was invited to a blogger's event and they gave us some S some Catrice products to try out. They are amazing. And uh, this month they gave us the Essence pack because they didn't have all the stuff they wanted to give us on the day of the event. <laughs> so here it is, what gives it to me for PR purposes, but I'm showing this in the May shopping haul just the same because it's such a cute package we really wanted to give a mention to so yeah it's an essence goodie bag and i will have a whole video on this little bag right here up very soon more products that i wanted to mention are these pop-up products one it's a cream eyeshadow vamp it's velvet matte and it's in the shade this is in the shade 004 and the lipstick is in the shade 002 these as well were sent for PR purposes, but I'm gonna show them to you just quickly because they're really pretty products. How the matte um, velvet mousse eyeshadow looks like. It's very, very pigmented. It's very light. It's great to use as a base before eyeshadow, so the eyeshadow can adhere better to the surface when it's, it has like something on like a primer or like a base and then the lipstick is the one that I have on it's such a gorgeous color I paired it up with an it's style lip liner which is in the shade 17 this is the lipstick it's a gorgeous orange shade I don't know if you can see but it has a tiny little spot at the middle and that is filled up with kind of serum I guess to moisture the lips it's out of focus I think it has a kind of serum in the middle to moisture the lips. It feels real moisturizing. Like it's so soft. It smells amazing by the way. But I'm not gonna go into detail because I wanna do a review blog post on this. So if you're not following me on my Facebook page, go following me on my Facebook page and on my blog. All links are listed down below so you don't lose a thing. Okay, so those are the stuff that were sent for PR purposes. Now, passing on to stuff that I got. First, I got this stuff. I'm not gonna try on everything because I don't feel like it today. Sorry, guys. But I'm on a roll. I just filmed three videos or two, so... Wait, this is a top. It's a coral kind of top. It has fabric material at the front and then it's chiffon at the back. I just love these tops for summer. They're amazing. And I'll show you in a minute, I got these in four colors and they are um, low high, I think they're for low high, like they are short from the front, not very short, but they are longer from the back. I love to wear leggings, so they kind of hide your butt because leggings are not very fluttering with your butt showing that much. Yeah. I really love these with shorts as well and skirts. I love these. I love these. These are a steel layer, just five euros, and I bought them from the shop in front of JB Stores. I think in a clean, I think it's called five to I don't know something five, something five. And these are just five euros. I got the peach one. I got the beige one because a neutral color is always handy. Of course, I got a black one and I also got a white one, which I think is in the laundry. Second product that I, not product, second clothing item that I got is this cute leopard shorts from Terra Nova. It's kind of the 80s, 80s style kind of shorts. It's, I don't know how to describe this material, but this material is kind of the 80s material there were lots of stuff in the 80s with this material it's kind of um has holes through it i'm not good at explaining stuff i'm just not good at explaining stuff can you see that kind of material if you know what that that material is called just let me know in the comments um this comes in an elastic kind of thing which is very comfortable especially for summer and if you tend to get bloated 
good for you to use your best friend because in summer I don't like very tight clothes except if I'm going out like clubbing or stuff or I like I sacrifice myself to look good yes I do that but for every day give me loose clothes I live in my kind of gym clothes and this me and from the shop that I mentioned earlier the shop where I got these from the tops I also got this for five euros I think that it's a really vintage looking top once it's on like once I have tried it on, by the way, I try nothing in, in shops. I just buy them. 99% of the times they are perfect fitting. But if I find something that it's like horrid on me, I just take it back. I don't like to take everything off in shops and put them on again, especially in summer. Those who know me know I'm not a summer person, so that heat, all that sticky. Oh, oh, oh. Anyways, this is the top. It's really, really, really cool. A cool looking top. It's striped. It kind of comes in a turtleneck. I don't know if you can see. It's, it's a really cool top. But once you put this on mm, near the neck, the neck area, it's not that perfect looking. So we have to adjust it. But other than that, it's very pretty. It comes in a between kind of sleeve. It's not a crop top, but it's not normal length, like it's not, doesn't have a normal length, but it's not a crop top and it comes in like a box shape kind of shape. Okay, so passing on to the next item that I got is this denim, I don't, no, it's not denim, it's just normal fabric, it's a plain white trousers. I had one, I had a denim jeans, denim jeans of course, it's a, it's a denim, it's a jeans. I had a jeans from Bershka, it was white and I couldn't find it anywhere so I went out and got this, then after a week I found it. If this happened to you guys, like you're searching for something and you are sure that you've lost it, you go buy another one like it or similar to it, then when you, as soon as you buy it, you find it. That is so annoying, so annoying. I got it from Piazza Italia, it was really really cheap because it was on sale, so it was just a new rose. So I just have a backup, you can never have enough basics and neutral stuff in your wardrobe so I'm not regretting this at all. It's a very light fabric. Also, you know, I noticed the little details a lot. The label has a little tiny bow. I'm not sure if it's up. Can you see that? Like, those little things right there just win my heart. Focus you. I feel like I'm all over the place today. I hope that you're getting what I'm saying, but I feel like I'm just rambling randomly. Some other stuff I got. I got a backup of the St. Moritz um, self tenor. This is in the same. In the, this is this is in the shade dark. It's my holy grail. If you follow me, you know how much I love this style. This style. You know how much I love this thing. Oh my god, today I'm all over the place. Um, I'm not ten. Like I, I'm, I haven't tanned right now, but if I do, I will definitely use this one. It's the first one that I ever used, and I've been using this for like two years now, like two summers, because I don't tan in winter. And yeah, this is best, best, the best. So tanning mousse out there. It's a mousse, and it's just six euros. I managed to find this locally. I'm sorry, I'm looking there. I'm supposed to be looking there. I managed to find this locally. I bought this from the jumbo stores, and yeah, I usually got this from Feel Unique or Look Fantastic, but it's the same price as online, so I got it from here. I have another two bottles, but I'm afraid that I will run out of it, so I got a backup. Then I got some lashes. These are like mini, not mini lashes, but they are kind of a half. Weft, I'm not sure that you say weft. No, weft is for the hair. It's a half strip kind of lashes. These I got them from the Euroland. These were one euro in fact. And then I got some of these. These are so so pretty. They are Resilient System Natural Lash Eye Lashes. And can we take a moment to appreciate the beauty of these lashes? They are so fluffy. I haven't opened them yet because I really wanted to show you like how they came in the packaging um, they are really 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 pretty they are so fluffy really long they are kind of like the ardent the wispies 
kind of lashes, but they have some tiny little hairs which are longer than the rest. Yeah, I really can't wait to play with them and I'm looking forward to using these in the tutorial. I know I'm out of focus, but I'm really looking forward to using these in a tutorial, so yeah. By the way, I filmed this look without this lipstick because I had a black lipstick on, so if it's not up, watch out for it and if it's up, i link it in the video. Then I also got this Yankee Candle. I got this like three months ago, but I put it in place like because okay let me explain this to you guys when I buy stuff in a particular month I put them in a bag so that I don't forget anything I always forget something like I am sure I forgot loads of stuff in this month's haul uh, whatever and this I put it in place and I've been used burning this ever since so I forgot to haul it but I'm doing so now it's the Yankee Candle Strawberry Buttercream Candle I bought I don't think this is the biggest size Because this is 623 grams. I believe there is bigger than this. This was something on the 25 euros I really 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 love Yankee candles, but this was a bit of a disappointment I must say it smells amazing from the jar like when I smelled it at the supermarket It was just divine. I couldn't wait to get home and burn it, but it was a little bit of a not a little bit, what a disappointment because once you burn it, it kind of doesn't make any sense into the room. Maybe because I have an open plan, so I have a big area kind of, so this scent kind of diffuses a lot. I don't know, I think it will be better in a closed room. It does, you know, it does. You know, you smell a little bit of it, smell like a faint smell, but it's nothing as strong as the cookie one. I had the cookie one, it was a limited edition for the Christmas one, and you could smell it from outside, like legit. That was one of the best candles that I have ever had. It was so, so, so yummy. Yummy. Not looking yummy. It was so yummy, but this, I think that because I'm comparing it to that one, that's why I don't have, I had Lots of high expectation but on this one, but long story short, this was quite a disappointment. Yeah. As I mentioned that I got the big top, so it's still nice, like I don't want to this Yankee Candles because I love them. I'm a huge Yankee Candle fanatic, but this didn't meet my expectations. Like from the jar, it smells divine. Once you burn it, not as much. Then my mom got Skylar some panties. These are so cute. These are so cute. Can you see? I especially love this color right there. I'm potty training him, so I need as much panties as I can get because he's always like, you know, tiny little accidents. If you're a mommy and you've potty trained your kid, please give me some advice. Like, he is, he's a good boy, like, he listens and he knows where he has to do his business, but sometimes he gets a bit lazy, like all kids do, especially boys, you know, boys are a bit more lazier than girls, so yeah, if you have some tips, bring them over. Next up, I bought 10 mini little jars from eBay, and these were super cheap, they are little container jars with a cute little pink uh, screw on lid. These, especially for DIYs and stuff like beauty stuff I am getting more and more into natural stuff lately so I really needed these I will let you know if I come up with something I will definitely let you know next I think that I got they are earrings they are cute silver earrings I'm more into gold as a person but they were in gold of these and I still think that they are very very cute I also got these from me Euroland, and I think they're so pretty and these kind of thingies move so and they would be really cool looking. Another two items that I got, I believe I got another one. Yeah. Yeah. Three items that I got are these what are are these lighters? I got three of them. I don't smoke, I don't smoke, but I just thought these were cute and I got them. I got them to light my candles mostly. If you don't know, I am a huge candle addict so I like I light like three every day 
I'm always running low on candles, I'm always buying candles. So yeah, these are so cute looking. Wait till it focuses. This is kind of a zebra print with flowers. This is kind of a, and these two are kind of a leopard print with flowers as well. They are so pretty, plus they light up so good. It's like I'm in a concert. Okay, there's my fan there, but they light up really, really great. And those were super cheap. They were like one euro each or two euros each. I'm not sure. Then I got two products from Body Shop. It is the Argan Oil Body Butter. I'm not sure. I really would appreciate if Body Shop kind of had the name of the product on the jar, or if I'm not seeing it, my bad. But there does doesn't seem to be any name to the product. But I believe that this is the Argan Oil range, the blue and that kind of beige kind of packaging. I believe this is the Argan Oil. This smells amazing! Like have ever smelled the Dior Hypnotic Poison perfume or the body lotion more of more. It's like more the body lotion. This smells so similar to it. It's such a good look, kind of because it's this is five euros. And the Dior Hypnotic Poison, I had bought the gift set for like 100 euros, so it is expensive. Uh, but this smells so, so much like it. I can't even begin to explain how much I love this scent. The Dior one is my favorite scent. Oh my god, this smells so, so good. Like, it's amazing. I am so glad I have found this. This is 5 euros or 5.95 or 4.95, not sure. But definitely big thumbs up. And I also got this pomegranate and raspberry home fragrance oil. Now again, this smells so so good from the jar, but once I poured it in my candle burner top thing or whatever it's called, and in my candles and stuff, it doesn't really make a scent. Which is disappointing because you guys have no idea how good this smells from the from the jar I've already like wait not wasted I've already used like half of it I don't know it's maybe because I don't have kind of a closed area where I can burn this it's like an open plan so this smell kind of diffuses much more than if it was in a closed room but I think I will be buying more just to see if it was just, just this scent or you know they're all like that because I have a friend and she told me that like they smell amazing and they kind of make the whole house smell nice so I'm guessing it's either because of because I have an open plan as I have said like four million times or maybe it's just this scent I don't know but I will buy more because this is under five euros and I think it's really inexpensive because you know oils are a bit expensive in general so yeah then I got this W7 Captain Matte Foundation. This comes in a squeezy kind of tube. I got it from the same um, chain supermarket in the point. They have like a beauty section, a makeup section. I like this because it comes in an easy to apply kind of tube because I go like this all over my face and then I blend with a brush. I don't know. I have used this once or twice and I had some sort of higher expectations to it and it didn't quite deliver as much as I wanted to it's matte so it's really matte I think I had some dry patches and the product kind of adhered to those dry patches so if you have this or if you want or if you want to buy this make sure your face is moisturized I will definitely do a full review on this one and I will let you know if I like it how I like it and yeah by the way I got mine in the shade natural beige yeah, yeah, this is it. Oh, and yeah, that kind of beauty section in the supermarket stock W7 don't have like a huge amount of product and range, but they do stock it. So then, last things that I got, I got some new look makeup. Just in case you're wondering, new look fashion brand launched makeup. Yeah, that's right. I have to say that from a brand that it's not focused on makeup, like 
it's a fashion brand, it's focused on clothes and shoes and bags and accessories, it's not focused on makeup. I didn't have that much of a high expectations when it comes to makeup. I always do like when a brand, a fashion brand launches makeup, I never have high hopes. Like even from H&M, I never had high hopes and I tried it and I was blown away. And the same happened with the new look makeup. They are amazing. They not exceeded my expectations, but went beyond. Like for example, I'm gonna start with the lipstick first of all. I really like the packaging. Like, you know, I have an eye for detail. The packaging is a mix between gloss and matte finish. Like, I don't know if you can see. I mean, it's nothing fancy, just black, right? But these stripes, these mixed stripes, kind of catch my eye and make me value the product more. Lipstick comes in a black tube. Again, it's a matte black tube and it has the glossy finish right there. Now, this is in the shade shell pink if i'm not wrong yes it's in the shade shell pink it's not a matte lipstick it's a glossy lipstick it comes with the curve kind of thing so you can apply this better it is super 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 pigmented it's super creamy it smells really nice as well and yeah this exceeded my expectations i love it i just love it i posted a picture with this a while ago and it's amazing then i have two of their baked eyeshadows by the way the lipstick is something like five euros and even these are 4.95 i got two of their baked eyeshadows i'm gonna swatch just one so you get an idea but i will do a full video or post on them so make sure to follow me everywhere basically this is the outer packaging it comes in a lid not a lid but you know it closes with a lid kind of package and you guys have no idea how pigmented this is like I've twirled my finger a few times in the product and this is what you get. Is this amazing or what? It is such an amazing pigmentation. It's gorgeous. I'm gonna swatch it right here so you guys can see. Like, oh my god. Can you see that? I mean, hello. And yeah. I believe this is everything I got for this month or else this is what I'm featuring this month. I'm sure there's more but I forgot. I feel that this video is gonna be way too long. This is my May shopping haul video. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you really did enjoy watching as usual and do subscribe for more videos. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye bye!